The information is information and fundamental fundamentals and technique is technique. <laughs> What is going on? I'm Igor Shalvarov and we are here at Independence Day Ball Dance Camps with Karina Smirnov. <laughs> Hi, Karina. Hi. First question. <laughs> Which direction you are taking your lectures? I was thinking southwest, but I think it depends which way you're facing. So which directions am I taking the workshop? Uh -huh. The One of the coolest things about IDB, Independence Day Ball Dance Camps, um, is that it has a lot of different categories and levels. We have pro-am students, we have social students, we have competitors, we have youth, we have kids who are 16, 14 and younger. Collegiate, that's, correct. Yes, that's also, well, not, I don't think they even in college, it's just USA Dance, I guess, um, under 21, uh, junior too. So it's a uh, it's very big, diverse crowd. Mm -hmm. Um, and a lot of times when we do lectures, um, of course, sometimes we have them sanctioned off only for juniors and youth. Um, but sometimes it's open to everyone. And when you have those lectures that are open to everyone, you have to make sure that you give something for everyone to walk away with. So, that is true. So it doesn't matter which uh, pretty much federation they belong to. Information is information. Absolutely. Information is information. And fundamental fundamentals and technique is technique. Mm -hmm. No matter matter what age or what level you are, you always have to stay true to fundamentals. And um, not only that, I think a lot of times people come to IDB in order to get inspired, maybe to get different ideas of which direction they want to take their dancing to. This year, there's so many incredible instructors from all over the world. Um, well, I'm from, all over the world. I'm from LA, so yeah, <laughs> I didn't travel deal. that far. I remember you and I have talked a little bit. What is the biggest pet peeve that you have? And I am going to give you a little hint. Arm styling? No. Balance? No. Shoes. Oh, shoes. <laughs> well, our bodies were not designed to wear heels. So it's actually against the physical structure of our bodies. Because the moment we even put on a little bit of a heel, our position and our posture should change to accommodate that height. Um, but we have to lock our knees, we have to straighten our leg, and we wear three and a half, three point seventy-five 3.75 inch heels. So of course it's not as comfortable. So I don't know if I'm going to do this particular time uh, at ID. Be, but I am planning on doing lectures about where the balance is, how to put your body weight in the right position when you wear heels. Mm -hmm. Because I think, um, as you know, you've tried it. Mm -hmm. um, the feeling is very, very different. In very heels. different and super uncomfortable if the weight is not in the. It's not, I guess, properly right. distributed. Yes, very okay. good, very good, properly distributed. That is so nice. I nailed that thing. He gets an A. Oh my God! Thank you, Karina. Karina. S Karina. <laughs> Smirnoff, <laughs> Igor Shalvarov, Independence Day Ball Dance Camp. Why is the Independence Day Bald? There's no D. Independence I did not, Day Ball. I so did not say that. What are you talking about? I didn't I say bald. I, I thought I heard Independence I into, Day Bald. I did not. Independence no, Day Bald. No.